everybody, this is JW Nigerian. I'm here today with Thomas Spores at the Gravity Summit. How you doing? Great. How are you? And great. So you just spoke. Yeah, it was really fun actually. It was, uh, it was, it, this is a great conference and uh, I'm really excited to be here. Yeah, well the Gravity Summit's about, well this year it's themed about sports and entertainment, uh, social media, marketing, social technologies. Right. And you're a... iOS programmer. <laughs> and what, do you, what, quite, what apps have you written? I have, uh, I have uh, uh, several. Um, I have uh, my first app was Earth Fortune, mm -hmm. uh, which is kind of a, like a fortune teller. And um, my favorite is Bustin' Jeeber, <laughs> which is a anti Justin Bieber game where you uh, get to hit Justin Bieber in the face. <laughs> it's kind of like a whack-a-mole board kind of thing. Uh, oh man! So do you you don't like Justin Bieber that much, or you just thought that kids some kids would have fun? No, no, I, I, it's kind of fun actually uh, playing the game, but um, I don't dislike Justin Bieber that much. It's, <laughs> it, I don't think his music is that bad. I don't think he's, he's that bad, but, um, but it was just fun. It was just fun. Yeah, yeah that's great. So, what you, you talked today a little about Sopa and Pipa. What was that about? Yeah. Um, well, here's the thing. Sopa and Pipa. It's about stopping online piracy, but the only problem is. The people are saying, "Is this only step one of internet censorship hmm. in the U.S.? This is maybe this is step one because they're using the same technology that China's using to block their web pages." Right. So, yeah, and this is really about we, you know, we've all we've all known you've grown up with, and, and I grew up with an internet that was free, and we we realize that as you mentioned that you know, we don't want things, but you don't want your apps being stolen, of course. Right. But there has to be a better way, right? Right. I mean, hopefully this isn't. Hopefully, if, if these laws get passed, it won't be it won't turn into censorship. Um, there, when when um, the blackout happened on January 18th, and Wikipedia and Google and a few other sites blacked out their web pages, some of their web pages, uh, Wikipedia blacked out their whole site to show this is what it could be like if if they do another step of censorship. So, you know, there's there's two sides. There's pros and cons for each side, but I think. Uh, We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens, and hopefully this is not going to be going to turn out to be anything bad. That's great. Well, let's talk about the uh, the other exciting thing that happened. You recently spoke at TEDx in Manhattan Beach or something like that, and uh, you got a lot of hits on YouTube. Tell me. Yeah, um, it's it's been it's been incredible. I I never really I never thought it. I thought it was just okay. This is a fun event. I'm just going to go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do my little speech and five-minute speech, and I'm gonna be off. And some people listen to me, but I didn't because it was going up on YouTube. Um, I mean, I didn't even know then. It would. I thought it was just okay. Share it with your friends and family, or me. Share it with your friends and family. And um, but I didn't know it was gonna be. Uh, it was gonna turn out to be this big. Uh, Thomas, thank you so much. It was a great talk out there, and everybody should go to the internet and watch you speak at TEDx. That was great. Um, I really appreciate you coming on today and, and uh, you know, and speaking to us. It was a great talk. Right. Thank you. All right. Thomas Suarez, JW Nigerian, at uh, Gravity Summit.